Oh, this is Kevin from Ohio. I represent the Thieves Guild. Um, so we had this incident recently where one of our guys, part of the horde, um, as we are known, was uh, just trying to do some thievery. That's how we make our money. That's how we put food on the table for our children and stolen children. Ah, hashtag Anyways, the horde. I, I, yeah, I, I need your help. We need to ban assault weapons because these are the only things that we are afraid of. I, I've played Call of Duty. You can take multiple hits from a pistol. So if you try driving off intruders with pistols, it, it just it don't work. But yeah. it, as yeah. soon as a Giga Chad pulls out an AR-15, like it, 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 you've lost. Yeah. You, you have to retreat. There's you don't even you have the do. ability to so, go refuel and get some food and then, like, make yourself healthy again, right? Or am I mixing video games? No. I mean, if you try to run us off using pistols while we're banging on your windows for whatever reason, eyeing up the TV and your 100-pound girlfriend, I mean, like, what are we supposed to do once you pull out the AR-15? It's <laughs> hurting the thieves' guild. Not a single member of the Horde is okay with this. So will you stand <laughs> with us in banning these weapons? <laughs> I mean, we have to ask the Horde first, right? They are our you know, senatorial body on this kind of thing. That is true. We are very democratic, yes. um, sort of. You have to be a landowner. It's, it's just <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kowalski, anything else on your mind before I let you go? Uh, no, that, that was about it. I mean, it's. If if you have to use an AR-15 for home defense, I, I don't want to know who your enemies are, but uh, wow, you must have like the mob and the cartel after you. I, I would recommend moving. Uh, maybe look, you just like the FBI should put you in witness protection. Um, also, a shotgun for home defense is probably your best option. About as much kick as a rifle without the uh, threat of, you know, going through five sheets of drywall and taking out the cat or yep. the neighbor. And um, a shotgun yeah, just, shot. Just a thought. Pretty deadly. Uh, yeah, kind of no, blows through the whole uh, person's whole chest. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Range. Even if they're wearing Kevlar, you're still knocking them on their ass. Oh, like, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. So, yeah. Oh, also, two things real quick. Um. Uh, most mass shootings are done with assault rifles for a couple of reasons. Um, <laughs> that's better for range, higher magazines, it's just why it's done that way. However, the maximum number of gun deaths is predominantly pistols because obviously suicides lead most of the gun fatalities. Uh, in most cases, that and pistols are far more common for interpersonal problems. But as far as like mass killing events, it is rifles just with the high yes. capacity magazine. So, yeah. Yeah. All right. I, I need to get back to the horde. Goodbye. Bye, Kowalski. Good luck, Kowalski. Don't run into any bump stocks. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. Sorry, guys. If I like being online. in your house and thinking, like, oh, yeah, I can safely spray uh, 90 rounds in like 60 seconds or whatever bump stocks can get up to. Like, that's going to really save me. <laughs> I mean, uh, you, you, you need to protect the 100 pound girlfriend. In case that. the Dallas Cowboys are invading my <laughs> apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Uh... <sighs>